I feel I gotta do. And I know without heroes can be a team effort. For sure. How much do you guys think, hey, we all gotta do more, maybe what's your mindset? Um, you know, Harry was a big piece of the defense, um, and you know, that was a big loss to us, but you know, the next man up mentality and you know what I'm saying it's gonna take the whole room now. You know what I'm saying? Everybody gotta step up their game just a little bit more. The, the intensity gotta be a lot higher. And you know what I'm saying, we just gotta bring it each and every day. How do you feel? Um, Oh man, I feel good. Uh, you know, I've been here for a year now. Um, you know, kind of studied the game, um, especially coming in this uh, this off season. Um, I got with the coaches, got got a lot with Coach Crow and Vrabel. Um, just kind of fine tuning what I need to fine tune. Um, so, you know, I feel good coming out there, and I feel like I can you know, help out this year. For sure. Right, my bad. Yeah. Mike Vrabel said that you know when you came here. You told him you wanted to be more than just a special team player. He For challenged sure. you to find a role. How do you feel you've done it? Um, so far, I feel like I've done decent, um, but you know, now I got to take the next step. Now I got to take that 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 role, and I got to grasp it, and you know, what I'm saying I got to take a hold of it, and, and basically, you just keep doing what I got to do to show that there's no drop off. And then being named the captain for the first time, how personally do you take that? <laughs> and, and you know, having to be someone to set the tone, having to be someone to keep the the morale and, and the vibe right in the locker room. Oh man, like I said earlier, I just got to come in here each and every day and keep doing what I've been doing. Um, like I said, so far everything I've been doing so far has gotten the respect of the guys. So as long as I keep doing that each and every day, I think I'll be good. Uh, kind of just a little bit, you know. It's definitely kind of some exciting to see just you know us being with Weave when he was still in you know what I'm saying college and me and Bud being together and then Derek also being there as well. Just kind of it's kind of ironic and everything just that lines all together. Each and every day, just going out there with a purpose, just to make an impact on the team and just keep grinding. How much has Ryan Tannehill just kind of been a steady and presence for you? He, he spoke just now about how you've been able to adjust and overcome the different things. Um, I would just say just establishing that relationship with him, um, just knowing where I need to be in the route, and um, just going to play ball. Um, I would just say it's always been a grind with me, um, just with just going through everything, just making sure that I'm mentally tough, just knowing that I, um, that I can get through anything as long as I put my mind to it, and then also just um, doing it to gain the trust and uh, accountability of uh, all my teammates and just going out there and playing. Traylon, how excited are you just for your first professional um, game? I mean, have you been kind of just counting the days down? Uh, I would just say words can't explain. I'm just ready to get back out there and play ball with the, with the guys. What do you see out of this Giants defense when you guys have been on film this week? I don't know how much you've watched yet. Um, I would just say they're, you know, really talented. Um, and, you know, we just got to go out there and play our brand of football and then the outcome will be the outcome. So much change for you um, like I said before, it's just a, it's a grind. Um, as long as you put your mind to it, you can do anything and just keep getting better and better each day. Um, I would just say, just um, go out there and play my brand of football and then the team's brand of football. Um, be physical, fast, and just go have fun. Trey, what do you think you learned about yourself just during this process of everything you went through during the spring and summer to get to where you are now about to play your first real life? Um, I would just say being mentally tough um, and also just uh, knowing knowing who Christ is and keeping him always with me and my faith and uh, just just playing ball. Our coach want to give us the best opportunity to go out there, play fast, and win, so that's what we've been doing. What do you think of their secondary? You'll probably be matched up a lot with Darnay Holmes. Yeah, uh, I'm excited to go against Darnix. You know, we played uh, at UCLA together, so, uh, you know, got a little knowledge uh, of him under. So I'm uh, real excited to go against him, just real excited to see him again also. And then speaking of you, UCLA, uh, just a watch, like, very advanced route running, understanding the spaces. Mm -hmm. right? How much did Chip Kelly's scheme just really uh, prepare you to you know, hit the ground running the way you have? Yeah, uh, I feel like he prepared me tremendously. You know, um, he expects a lot out of his players. You know, it's not just shredded plays here with there. You know, there's a lot of reads within the routes in the play. So um, it's really difficult to learn at first, but um, made the transition to the NFL a little bit more easy. Do you think that was kind of like a key for you to be able to, to play so fast and so quick right away? Yeah, for sure. You know, so I'm super thankful to Coach Kelly and all those coaches over there. How excited are you for this win and countdown today? 
<laughs> been trying not to think about it too much. You know, I want to focus on these next couple of practices, keep getting better. But uh, yeah, I'm real excited for it. You talking to the veterans during this week, and I know you, you seem like a pretty cool, calm, collected guy in Cali. But, you know, any kind of words of advice you get? Um, you know, just just focus and be where your feet are. You know, don't make the moment bigger than what it is, and just go out there play and you know have fun. At the end of the day, you know. Special team, sorry, special team <laughs> focus, especially coming out of the gate. Like how how sharp do you know you have to be, and just how much of focus goes on that. A whole lot of folks, you know, especially um, what I'm what, what I can contribute is you know on punt return, you know, just making sure you know I catch every ball that's off the foot, and uh, yeah. Trying to mention, you can even see on tape maybe the jump in intensity. Have you, have you seen that? You've seen that yourself? Uh, jumping in intensity, maybe referring. Maybe just the jump in intensity from preseason to maybe regular season. Oh yeah, for sure. Um, so, you know these these are the games you know count towards your record. So these are the most important ones. So yeah, it's been real intense in uh, practice and meetings, and it's been fun. What's it like? The build up has been so long. You've been since May, working towards mm -hmm. this moment. I mean, are you? What's the feeling now, just days away? Uh, yeah, no, like I said, you know, I'm try trying not to think about the game too much. I want to focus on these next couple of days, but uh, I'm re real excited playing the first game and uh, even got my parents coming out. So this is the first game they'll be at. So real excited for that. Uh, I think we got a real talented group. Um, can do a whole lot of different things. We each have a different set skill set. So it's uh, real unique and going to be real fun. Uh, not too much. In my later years of freshman year, I played pretty much every special teams as well. But uh, later years, I, I kind of fell off because my role got bigger. Sure. So how, how, what's that adjustment like to get into doing that against the best players in the world? It's definitely it's a, it's a huge adjustment. You just you got to learn techniques and just know that your your talent not always going to win. So you got to find the fundamentals that that help you that help you uh, overcome those those difficult ba battles that that you're going to face. I'm sure you've been counting down the days to this one. Uh, yep. What has it been like this week, kind of preparing, keep your mind focused, but also being able to be excited about this one on Sunday? Uh, you, you know, you, you still got to come here every day with, with the same mentality as you did during camp. Uh, just come out here. It's different because it's a game week. Now you're going against another team and everything, but um, it's, it's, it's definitely been exciting. Um, I, can't, I can't wait for it to happen. How big is, is being, you know, on that special teams unit in this one, and really, you know, making sure every play matters? Uh, every every play is huge, but definitely being on that special teams is huge because because not everybody gets to play special teams, and not everybody uh, gets the opportunity to, to play in general. So, if I'm on special teams, I'm, I'm playing it like a, like I'm playing a running back, and I'm playing it as hard as I can, and, and trying to do the best I can just to make sure I, I do everything the best of my ability. Uh, like I said, I'm just looking forward to getting back on the field and get this year going. Um, I kind of, like I said, just try to stay in shape. Uh, worked out a little bit, had a chance to work out, get stronger. Um, to work on my movement. Yeah, that's about it. What do you think you will see in the Giants? What kind of challenge they present right out of the game? Um, just running the ball, you know, just trying to stop the run. We can get the run stopped, that would be pretty good. Uh, it's kind of kind of a clean slate. Last year has nothing to do with this season. Um, just something just got to go out and prove that we are who we are. I'm sure, I'm sure somebody's asked. You talked the other day about not playing Harold's position, but the depth chart they put out has you in Harold's position. Is that meant to confuse us and throw us off, confuse the Giants and throw us off? I, I really don't don't know what they got going on. Um, I'm just I'm just here to do my job. <laughs> Appreciate it.